questions I get asked quite a bit is, do street signs still work? Uh, street signs are commonly known as bandit signs. And what these are, these are signs that uh, investors, real estate investors post in neighborhoods that says something to the effect of, uh, we pay cash for houses or we buy your house fast or sell your home fast, right? And so what you do is you get these signs made up and they're called bandit signs because um, most city ordinances don't allow them. So to avoid the city coming through and picking up these signs or to get any fines is you post them outside of the hours that city ordinance people work. So that means usually after five o'clock or six o'clock, you go through and you can post these signs. Uh, the bad thing is you have to then go pick them up the next morning before these guys come through. Uh, what a lot of people will do is they'll post them up, they'll put them up on a Friday at five and then they only have to take them down like uh, Monday morning, early Monday morning. Okay. Uh, so the, the other thing is a lot of uh, neighborhoods or people in the neighborhoods don't like these signs. I remember I spent, I don't know how much money I spent, but I had ordered like a hundred of these signs and I was going through and posting them up all throughout these various neighborhoods. But I would go through and I'd watch these signs. I didn't bother with these uh, taking them down because I figured if they were going to find me, I'd figure it out and then I would adjust my strategy. So some areas don't uh, don't find you or they don't bother finding you. So it, it all depends. You can try them out in your neighborhood. Do they work? That's the big question. Out of all those signs, and I spent a lot of time, a lot of money, I don't think I got any calls from these uh, signs. So uh, you can try them out in your neighborhood. Some people swear by them. Uh, they seem to work in some places, but they're also expensive and time consuming. An easier approach is just to put up a Facebook ad saying we buy houses, right? Or put up a, an ad in one of the uh, um, for sale by owner sites. I've done that before where I've, I've run on Craigslist or Kijiji, you know, we buy homes uh, and you can promote these ads so they can get front and center of, of everybody. So I don't recommend these bandit signs anymore. Um, again, I don't think I ever recommended them because they never worked for me. But again, try them out if you like them, if it makes sense for your neighborhood, maybe it's a small town, maybe people will like that. And I mean, you build up a brand that way, make sure you have some kind of branding on it. Uh, and these signs are supposed to look ugly, right? If they're too fancy, then people don't uh, call them. I, I read and I've heard where people will take a literally a black marker on a white piece of cardboard and write, we buy houses and those outperform any other of these signs where you can actually get them made up and printed and looking professional because people who are trying to sell their home fast don't usually want to talk to professionals because they're intimidated and they don't like their to them to know the situation they're in. Okay. So if you like what you heard and you want more information on how to get started with real estate investing and how to grow your portfolio fast, go to invest.jimpelleran.com.